All right, hey everyone. We are live streaming Journeys in Middle Earth. So it looks like we got a little bit of chop from the highly animated screens, but hopefully that'll be okay once it's just sort of looking at a battle map and all that. So without further ado, should we get started? Stop with the ado. No more ado, I promise. Andrew made me swear. <laughs> no more ado. <laughs> all right. Let's go ahead and just do the normal difficulty, yeah? Unless okay. you guys are feeling particularly masochistic. Is it still called nightmare mode? In this? Uh, what is it? Just hard. Oh. <laughs> I liked it when it was nightmare. Yeah, I did too. All right. Did you get these tiny little baby card sleeves? Yeah, I did. These of are course so I cute. Did. What's up, honey? Okay. Uh, all right. We've got a little hobbit homesick today, so... All right, let's select some heroes here. So I'm gonna play Barivor. Andrew, you're Gimli. And Lyd, you are Elena. I am. I'm always the elf. Yep. Forever an elf. Okay. Selecting starting items. We're just going with the default selections. I think that makes the most sense. Party name. Oh, don't ask. Oh, boy. Mac Trace. What? You know, Mac 3. Oh. I like my uh, cards, Cloak and Dagger, like that band from when we were... Also, younger. the common saying. No, like the band. The band, yeah, my bad. All right, uh, we need to... I'm just going to call this Castle Mac. Boom. 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 Because, I mean, we pretty much are the key part of Castle Mac, I've yeah, said. Yeah, definitely. Oh, here we go. Shh, shh, shh. Are you ready to aid them? I will do it. I was born Who's ready. prepared to aid? Okay, okay. alright, then we can embark. Actually, I need to get a few things. <laughs> wait, 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 wait! Can we go shopping in Middle Earth first? Middle Earth adventure! Middle Earth Costco. Oh man, love fantasy Costco. Alright, here we go. You guys ready? We're at the South Downs. We're playing a shadow in Eriador. The theft of the Maytham House is the talk of the Shire, for seldom do the Shire folk play a role in the larger world, and so these events seem small, as small as a hobbit. But one small fellowship has gathered together to seek out these brigands. Let's get some brigands. Alright, I am playing the Pathfinder. Gimli, you are the Guardian, and Elena is the Musician. Mm -hmm. Alright, everyone take a look at your cards. What, what do you do? Um, I'm good at giving people these. Are these still called inspirations? Yeah. I can't remember. Yeah. Uh, yes, they are inspiration. Okay, I'm really good at giving inspiration to people. Cool. I'm also good at playing the harp. I am good at defending people. And killing people. And, and killing people. Yeah. Defending and killing folk. Just like in real life. Just like a regular old dwarf. I'm good at moving around quickly Don't and doing consider. stuff. So I'm pretty fast to like, like, oh, there's a thing over there. Let me go check it out. Taste the earth. Look at some tracks. Wait, who are you again? Barivor. Oh, okay. She's a ranger. She's married to the earth. Okay. All right, let's go. Just like you're married to your Tesla now. You mm. lost your wedding hmm? ring. Huh? What? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Still waiting on the paper paperwork. Um, I'm gonna go into your uh, trunk one day and just find your wedding ring like around a random. <laughs> 
All right, somewhere amid this maze, this font is like, maybe I'm just old. It's hard to read the like yellowy font against black. Somewhere amid the maze of dark thickets and steep gullies, the band of thieves now hides. Your direction is informed by a set of tracks from two days ago, and you can only guess the location of the thieves' lair. You guys get all that? Yep. yep. All right, tile 302A, please, Andrew. Oh, you're in charge of monsters, if you wouldn't mind sorting them, so it'll make it easier oh, for boy. you. Oh, boy. I yeah. never know which ones they are. I had to put you in charge of monsters. All right, let's see here. Boom. How's the... Are we okay? Here, I'll, I'll get... Let's move Camera Diaz a little closer. We can adjust as needed. I love Camera Diaz. Are they, like, how do I know? Um, They're all just the same sculpt. Are they? Okay. Yeah. All right. We're going to probably need some more here. Oh, hold on. Heroes go in this square here. Okay. We need Hero Scouts, too. Oh, do we do that now? Yeah. What do we do? We're going to scout, too. Go oh, ahead. Oh, you, yeah. you can do your thing first. Go ahead and get those guys sorted. Okay. Do you want to talk about something while I do this? Yeah. Um, um, hey. <laughs> hey, look. Is uh, this a is this a, a winter wolf? Yeah. Because you know what? We're going to pet it? I'm just saying I would yeah, pet it. Right, I'm just saying he's yep. a good boy and I would pet he him. He is a good boy and has earned a, a scritch behind the ears. Like if I was about to go out of town for a little bit, <laughs> I would definitely pet him like first. Like if I had travel for work. <laughs> and I like would, I wasn't even in a hurry, I would I definitely would just... that good boy's ears. I would absolutely just if give wanna, him a... If you want to go ahead and scout too now, go ahead. That's three cards, right? No, just two. Is it two? Aragorn gives you the bonus one, but oh, man. you're just scouting two. Why can't you play Aragorn? So I don't know how shuffled your deck is. You might. Want I just to shuffle. shuffled okay, it. Okay, all right, cool. Okay, briefly explain to me a little bit, like g just go over the basic rules again, and like. Yeah, the remember up, up in here. the top left, you've got the success symbol. Which is, is the, the like star, one. yeah, and, and then, then you've the, got the leaf, uh -huh, which is uh, inspiration. Which is inspiration. So where you, you have spend to spend those inspiration to beat mm -hmm. the puzzle that we have, and then I can also choose to keep one of these as yeah. You pre it's called prepare, and by the way, you should have one prepared. I think you shuffled it in. Oh shoot! Your your basic one for you it'll be musician one should be automatically prepared at the start of each adventure. So oh, okay. You're gonna need to look through your deck. And yeah, find yeah. It. it always starts prepared. And then how many successes do I have in my deck? Two or three? I think you start with four. Oh, okay. I think there's four out of so with one prepared, you're gonna have four out of fourteen cards being a success. Okay. So keep that in mind as your as your. Uh, doing stuff around the board. What? Yes. Yeah, go ahead. Um, as many as you need. What is it called? I oh, feel better. Love you. Just, if you look at the bottom, it's going to be green, and it's going to say Musician 1. Oh, okay. I got it. Ooh, it's, um, is this Nate Guide? That's her, right? Or is that so. Daughter of the Nimmerdell? The art. It's been a while. I, I can't see it, so I don't know. All right, so you get that one prepared. Then you're going to shuffle and scout two. And of those those two cards, you can prepare one. And then the remaining ones can go either to the top or the bottom of your deck. The remaining one. Well, you don't ha if you don't prepare one, oh, okay, you'd have yeah. two. So each one, you can make the decision to go top or bottom. Now, a lot of cards are going to have text. And then... Lid? A lot of cards are going to have text and then also a bolded keyword. Those bolded keywords on the bottom, if it's prepared, you discard it to do that. The text above, otherwise, might not be a discard unless it says, like, some things are passive. Yeah, like, yeah, you yeah. might have a card that says, like, every time this thing happens. Like, mine, my trailblazer says, before you sprint, gain an inspiration. That's passive. Yeah. And then below that, it says, sprint one. During your turn, you can discard this card to sprint one. So yeah. some things are discard effects, some things are passive. Mine straight up says to discard, and then... Yeah, this one says to discard, too. Okay. Yeah, I'm just saying, be aware of... The text is pretty specific. Yeah, yeah. I remember what some of the cards do, but it's been a few weeks. So you're putting both on top and not preparing any? Correct. Okay. I am going to put this on top, and I'm going to prepare this. Um... What are your what are your character's abilities? It's probably worth making sure we all understand what all right. each other are capable of. Elena has two might, three wisdom, two agility, four spirit, and three wit. I, I just want to know your text. Oh. 
Once per test after you spend one inspiration, and nearby hero gains one inspiration. Ah, so nearby, if you recall, is adjacent yes. or in the same space as you. So mm -hmm. when you spend it, one of us can get one. That's yeah. pretty awesome. What's Gimli's thing? After you attack, you may place one card from the test on top of your deck. Ooh, he's a killer. And Barivor is once per round, after you sprint, hide, or strike, you may scout one. So I, I can, if I move around, I can get through my deck a little bit. All right, I think we, we good to get back to setup. Yep. I'm still sorting the bad guys. All right, you want to listen to these real quick? Yeah. All right. A single shaft of light illuminates a low area where a battle was fought long ago, painting it in vibrant hues. That's this. A tremendous eagle rakes her talons across a jagged ridge. Okay. I need 100A, please, sir. I'm sorry if I'm deafening anyone, my microphone fell off. Rotate this to more closely match the app. Okay. 100A is placed. And in the distance, a group of ragtag individuals close the doors of a stone tomb. Could this be your quarry? The thieves you're looking for? Place a person token as indicated. Okay. And I need 203A, please, sir. A lot of those guys. Thank you. I do that right. There we go. My spatial awareness suddenly goes away when I'm being watched. All right. 203 is placed, and I need 101A. We don't start with any inspiration, do we? Uh, I don't think so, no. But don't you have a, your harp? Mm -hmm. What does your harp do? At the start of your turn, a hero in your space who has zero inspiration gains one inspiration. There you go. Who would benefit most from inspiration? Probably you, because then Can I you, give it to myself? Yeah, it's just oh, okay. a hero, not another hero. Because when you spend it, it it's, can go to someone else. It says a nearby hero. Can I be... Am I nearby? Can I do it to myself? Yeah, yeah. Nearby okay. isn't in, including the same the same space. You're always, I think, nearby to yourself. Oh, wait, I was reading... Yeah, 205A, yeah, yeah. please, sir. No, Rad Bully, don't do it. Rad Bully judged me for taking a long time setting him up. <laughs> Okay, this goes like this. All right, the initial map is laid out, I think. Okay, and three un unexplored tokens. So if you all recall, threat is something we have to manage. And threat goes up by two for every hero mm -hmm. and one for every unexplored location. Our next threat threshold is 15. So we right now are going up by nine. If we can eliminate those, we're only going up by six. What number do we thread out at? Uh, 64. Okay. We don't have time. No. <laughs> Pausing to tighten your boots and adjust the weight of your gear, you take a breath before continuing on. Each hero tests spirit. Each hero who passes gains one inspiration. You only need one success on spirit, so you're going to discard a number of cards equal to your spirit value. I know, I'm... Do I have to keep discarding until I... You have I... to. You okay. have to discard them all. So I drew two successes, which while it's nice that I passed, it sucks that I now have only two successes left in my deck. But oh my I did God. pass. I, I, I drew, drew three successes. Did you really? God, that sucks. Sweet. Yeah. yeah. I all drew right. one because I know how to play the game. Actually, my endless melody uh, allows me to draw a song from my discard pile. So it's not bad because some of these are songs. Oh, is it a discard to do that or something? Mm-hmm. It's m like my starting... Um, yeah. Cool. Okay, well, uh, I think with that we're off to the races. Objective is to confront the thieves. So just to reiterate what we have going on here, we've got the, the shaft of light illuminating a battlefield, the hawk attacking, a, like raking her claws on a cliff, these are the people at the tomb, and then this is the areas we need to explore. Who wants to go first? We can choose that every turn. Andrew. 
Okay. Yeah, do it. Um, mind if I talk to those guys? I Please. get an inspiration before I interact with people. So. Oh, yeah, cool. Hi. Okay, so you've done a move action, so you move there. What's and now, that? And now you're interacting with them. Yep. So, cool. Our move speed is what again? Always two. Always when you do two. a move, you get to move two. Okay, here we go. You are interacting with those folks. I'm trying to make sure the app is... Yeah, okay, we're good. It looks fine. You note the garb mimics that of Breelanders, but their accents are varied. These are not merely local riffraff. You pause and consider what is your best approach. Well met, friends. Sneak up and eavesdrop. Step away from the tomb or else. Or you can cancel. Uh, these tend to indicate what skill you're going to use. Right. So sneaking up would probably be a Legolas thing. Yeah. <laughs> probably not a dwarf thing. <laughs> yeah. Quunk. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I think well met, friends. Well met, friends. All right. That's probably going to be something like uh, wit. All right. Well, okay. So are we <laughs> doing what it feels like our character would do or... You don't uh, think Gimli would come in, axe in hand? My man tried to smash the One Ring within, you know, two minutes of his character introduction. Yeah. Um, not merely local riffraff. Alright, I'll, I'll be intimidatory, which is totally weird. Look it up, yeah, don't look it there up. There you go. Is that, can you see that better? Yeah. Alright, here we go. Step away from the tomb or else. A woman steps forward, foreign tattoos up her arms and across her face. You lost. She quips, snarling at your threat. Test might. You should be good at that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I'll spin it to get three. Got three. Ooh, boy. Gimli coming in hot. Okay. Gripping your weapons tightly, you meet her gaze squarely, never blinking. Her resolve withers and the rest of the group panics. To arms, you fools, she growls, though few turn to fight. As you suspected, these are the thieves you seek. Become emboldened. Ooh, I gotta get out the uh, condition cards. Mm-hmm. Let's see, where are the condition cards? I think they're right here, and I'm gonna put you in charge of those, Andrew, if that's okay with you, my dude. I suppose. Here's emboldened, and here are the condition cards. There's three of them. There's emboldened, hidden, and something else. Coach is making fun of my math skills right now. Oh, come on, Coach. What is Coach, a human calculator? That's what I asked. All right, become emboldened, discard the person token. Then, uh-oh, place two ruffians as indicated. Your enemy shows no signs of mercy nor any inclination that they will accept the same in return. With malice in their eyes, they raise their weapons, ready to defend what they have stolen. Place two ruffians as indicated. Yep. You may attack the ruffians without spending an action. Go for it, well, I do. well, do mind if I don't. Objective updated, defeat the ruffians. Okay. Uh, I have forgotten how attacking works. You <laughs> just use, you look use, at your oh, weapon. Oh, right, it's might. Yep. Okay, gotcha. Uh, one. Uh, 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 when you attack, add two hits, so I guess... Is that just passive, or is it a discard? From, from embolden. Oh, cool. Doesn't say anything about discarding it. No? Oh, thank you. Oh, yeah, check sure. Me out. I'll, I'll tell you. Look, let's see. It says, at the end of your turn, if there are no nearby enemy enemies, discard this boon. If you suffer damage or fear, discard the boon. When you attack, add two hits. So I think that's it. Yeah, it so adds two I... hits. But you got no successes, right? I got one success. Oh, you got one success. So so you can spin that, whatever you have on your axe. Right. So I got three hits, right? So. No. Oh, wait. You have right. successes, and successes convert to hits. Gotcha. Okay, hits so I like get. after. Then I get four hits and thunder. Four total hits? Four hits and Sunder. Which isn't going to do anything else. Nah, but... Sunder doesn't do nothing to him, unfortunately. Alright, well you hurt them pretty good, but didn't quite take one out. And they are now going to attack you back. Can the enemy attack? Yes, they can. Uh, don't forget your ability. You get to put one success back on top of your deck. It's Gimli's ability, right? Oh, right. You're right. Okay. You are taking three damage and one fear. Might negates. Okay. So then one, two, and then I shuffle. Then you right. Shuffle, yep. Went through those fast. Three. So I got two successes. 
Cool. So you get to negate two from either damage or fear. You've got three three damage, one fear coming in. Oh, I guess I'll make it one damage, one fear. Okay. Um. So now I discard my emboldened. Yep. You didn't get. Did you get hurt? Yeah. How and there's one of each. And they're face up, right? Yeah. What's your max? Mm, you can take a bit of a beating. Four fear, six damage. Um, each oh. nearby hero flips one uh, fear face up, then flips card face down. Doesn't matter. Cool. Keep the card face up. You cannot prevent damage, including negate tests. When oh, you, did you get rage? Yep. That, you attack it. That's it. both awesome and horrible. Yeah. What is it? He can't negate damage anymore. But what does I, that mean? Well, normally when you take damage, you flip cards to negate it with successes. Oh, right, 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 right. I got it. Yeah. That sucks. So he just takes all of it. But he adds two hits. Yeah. But it definitely sucks. Yeah. Although, I guess Gimli's probably the best one to have it. So, with healing, would that get rid of that card? If, if he has a rest, you can get rid of it, and some cards will let you get rid of him, too. Okay. What, what does your harp do again? At the start of your turn, here in your space gets one inspiration. Here in your space. All right. So you can't hook up Gimli. You can't yeah. hook up me. Um, how about I go next? Does that work for you? Because yeah. I can, I can, I'm gonna run through and get these explored. Absolutely. Right. Did my turn just end, or did it end? No, your, before your turn's he attacked not over. Me. Okay, no. so I could discard this to get rid of both of these. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, because technically you had one move left. They attack you back in reaction to your attack. Right. Okay. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that because I don't want rage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It kind of sucks. Cool. Do you want me to go next, or do you want to go? Because you could interact with these things if you wanted, or you could explore one of those, and I could explore farther. Okay, so this is the hawk. That's the no, hawk. that's the battlefield. Nope, that's the hawk. This that's is the, the battlefield. battlefield. Um, I want to... Can I go? Yeah, go okay. ahead. Um, I will... So this is move one. Move one. And then I'll explore the hawk. Check out that hawk. Yeah. A tremendous oh, it's an eagle. My mistake. Sorry. Birds of prey have been a real problem for us. They really have. We don't understand. A tremendous eagle rakes her talons along a jagged ridge. Offer to help? Yeah. Okay. So that's an action. You know eagles to be the foes of orcs and goblins and other dark things, and thus perhaps friend enough to you. The eagle stops raking spear-sized talons against the crags. Pardon me. When she spies you below. Hello, Landwalker, she says. Come nearer. I could use the aid of a creature of your rabbit-like stature. Approach to assist or agree to help from a safe distance. I'll approach. I feel like an elf would help a big eagle. Of course. <clears throat> All right. The eagle has made deep furrows in the ridge around a narrow alcove, too deep for her to reach with either talon or beak. You can make out several small birds huddling deep within. I carry an important letter from Rivendell. These swallows seized the letter case while I fed and hid it in there. You have heard of small creatures serving the purposes of dark masters. You dart your hand into the alcove and grasp for anything that feels out of place. Small beaks peck at your fingertips, but finally you grasp a leather case, which you easily steal away from the birds. Suffer one face down damage. Does your cloak do anything about that? Before you suffer damage or fear, you may spend one inspiration to prevent that. If you want to. How much damage can you take? Uh, four. So fuck it, I'm gonna do it. I okay. mean, why not? Cool. Alright. Then, the eagle graciously accepts the letter case, which you help to sling about her neck. Thank you, Landwalker, she says. I am called Alatrinar, a trusted messenger of the great eagles. This is an important missive to have been entrusted to my wings, and I will not forget this favor. Alatrinar agrees to carry you for a short distance while your paths remain the same, and then bids you farewell on your journey before her great wings lift her into the air to continue her own mission. You may move two spaces, then discard this search token. Cool. So I get to move two spaces for free because she's carrying me? She's carrying you. Okay, so I should probably go explore those things at the end because it's going to take us a while to get there. Yeah, I think and that makes sense. And those would give us um, threat, right? Yeah. If you can get these two, I can get the last one. Yeah, sir. So I'll have her carry me one and two. Cool. So we're going to do this one at a time. Mm-hmm. may move two spaces. I guess that counts as exploring it. Yeah, I guess it would. So we move here and reveal what's there. Don't you automatically explore something when you're yeah, in the space? Yeah, it's not an action. It's just free. All right. A winding dirt track peters off into the woodland. Discard the exploration token and gain an inspiration. Will do. 
Your journey continues. And then one more. Confirm the exploration. Sickly trees bend over shallow pools. Discard the exploration and gain an inspiration. Tight. Um, Your journey continues. My max inspiration is five, correct? Yeah, is that what it says in there? Mm -hmm. Yeah, mine's four, so... All right, I think so I actually only I still have one. You movement. still have one move left. I'm gonna go just explore that thing. So if you do that, you're gonna gobble up all the inspiration. You're gonna have three. I'm gonna have one. Okay. And well, I mean, you can. I'm just saying we should try to spread it out. I think. Okay, then I'll go backwards one. Okay. All right, my turn. Mhm. Mm so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna interact with this token. First and foremost, so I'm interacting with the battlefield. A single shaft of light illuminates a low area where battle was fought long ago. Passing through the low area, you stumble upon an ancient corpse, nothing remaining but bone and rusted metal. Its sword is planted into the ground beside it, its hand still on the hilt. Test spirit, needing one success. Got it. Means so I have one success left in my deck. <laughs> I have pass. Here lies a wanderer such as yourself, strong and vigilant to the end. Become determined or gain one inspiration. What does determined do again? Um, when you test, you may discard this boon to discard any number of cards from the test and reveal that many additional cards. What makes it go away? Doesn't Nothing? Alright, I'll become determined then. Feels like a better long-term investment. Okay. So that was one action. Then I'm going to discard Trailblazer, which has Sprint 1, but it also has, before you sprint, gain an Inspiration. Good for you. So What's gonna, your max Inspiration? Uh, four. So I'm going to Sprint 1 to there. Then with my second action, I'm going to go Move, Move. Yes, I would like to explore, please. Wind brushes over the grass, making the wood of an old... Gibbet? I don't know that word. Gibbet? Gibbet? Creek? Yeah, I get it. An old gibbet, gibbet creek ominously. Discard the exploration token. Gain an inspiration. An ancient spiral of stairs descends into the earth, carved into an even older cave. Just outside, a carving in the stone warns of danger. Uh-oh. Your journey continues. Well, that's it, I think, for us. We all did our two actions. The bad guys have already acted, so that should probably be the end of the turn. We limited threat. Feeling good, heroes. Let's end the turn. In the action phase. Yes, we will. Shadow phase. What happens during the shadow phase? The oh. shadow deepens, though hope yet endures. That's it. So rally phase, we now shuffle, shuffle. our decks. Hey, Blueberry, what's up, man? Rad Bully, that's right. Sparrow's absolutely evil. Also, weirdly, just before we started this, there was a bird scratching at the door outside. And I was like, what the heck is that? And I looked, and there was a bird like, yo, let me in. That's let so strange. In. I've never seen yeah, that. Yeah, it was probably sent from Mordor. Do you remember the other day there were two birds outside fighting? Yeah, that was crazy. What the fuck? All right, and then uh, we scout two. Bearing Poets Hardigan. Okay, I will prepare one and put one on the bottom. And with that, it's our turn. Uh, Andrew, you want to try to smash these dudes? Okay. I'll prepare that one. That seems good. During the rally phase, can you unprepare things? Uh, yeah, yeah. But, but you have to discard it. So you can, like... Put it in the discard. Okay. But you can have up to four things prepared. So. Yeah, just wondering. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, but it does have to get discarded, I believe. You attacking? Attacking these ruffians? Yep. Ah! Uh, one, so two hits, minus under. Did you, you... You didn't have anything else that gave you extra hits, right? Uh, no. All right. Don't forget, you can put one back on top. They're going to attack you back, but then you still got another action. Remove one ruffian. 
Can the enemy attack? Yes, indeed they can. Okay, you take two damage, might negates. Negated it both. Nice. Cool. Uh, but you have to test your whole might. All right. Okay. Cool. That probably worked out pretty good. Yep. And now you're going to attack again? Might as well. Okay. Oh, did I get an inspiration for killing that guy? Uh-uh. You got to no, kill, kill the whole, whole group. group. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, two hits, so six hits. There you go. Go oh, and I can put one on top. Yep. And with that, you or a nearby hero gain an inspiration. I presume you need that. Yeah, go I'll ahead. Take that. And the ruffian is defeated, Lid. As the queen of monsters. Plus one lore. Sudden movement draws your eye. To your surprise, a goblin breaks cover and sprints away, disappearing into a wall of brambles. You follow with haste and find, beyond the thicket, a wide valley dotted with a few ruins, but no sign of the creature. All right, tile time, 308A. Okay. Uh, Okay. Oh, I should have scouted one after sprinting. I forgot my character ability. Dang. Gotta remember all those character abilities, y'all. I will not. That would have been great. Okay. Uh, need 201B. Two oh one B goes like that. Did I do that right? Uh, like this. No, I think it is like this. Yep, it's like that. You sure? It looks like it lines up on one, two, three, four, five lines. And this is one, two, oh, three. I see. Yeah, it's actually like this, isn't it? It's like that. Yeah. It's like those that. corners. Like that. Like that. And exploration tokens. Okay. Is that tokens? Explore? Uh, that was the... Light, didn't you do that? Yeah, yeah I did. You're right, you're right. Yep. Thank you. Good eyes. Thanks. What has drawn such a creature here, far beyond the reach of any orc stronghold? Its armor bore resemblance to that of Mount Graham, but far to the north does that mountain stand. A dark alliance has been formed indeed for such a creature to be summoned here. You must find tracks leading to the enemy's lair to continue... Searching the surrounding area will yield the clues and tracks you need. Tracks needed? Three. Let's go find some tracks. Let's track, some tracks. track up the jam. Tracks and snacks. Well, do you want to go first or do you want me to go first? I have three inspiration, so if you want to go do some exploration. You didn't let me make it. my joke about being on the wrong side of the tracks. Oh, you cut me right I'm off. Sorry, go ahead. Well, I don't want to get on the wrong side of the tracks. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. <laughs> Zing. <laughs> Okay. All right, let's get back on track. Yeah, I'll go first. Get it. Me neither. Going? Yeah. Where to? Um. Hmm? One, explore. Yep. Okay, so moving and exploring. I'll take that yet. Let's see what we got here. A gentle hill rises above you, sloping up to a single high perch built in an old oak. A bandit gang might make use of such a lookout perch, but so might anyone hunting bandits. Discard the token and gain an inspo. Okay. And high in a tree, oh, you wait, see... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I also get to give myself one. No, you got to start with zero. No, my harp? It's always? It's not just when you start with zero? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. Okay. What is your character's ability again? After I spend one inspiration and nearby hero gains one. Oh, yeah, oh. That's awesome. High in a tree, you see a shoddy platform crafted from old lumber. I already put that down. The vantage point might make it easier to spot signs of the thieves. And looking down a muddy ridge, you notice what may be tracks on the shore. The way down, however, is steep, slippery, and bears no clear path. Wow, more. Uh, a rustling of leaves in the underbrush warns you of animal life. This search token has indicated. Oh, good. So you've done one move so far? Uh-huh. Oops, put a person token. Oh my um, so I automatically get to interact with that, right? No, it takes an action. Oh. And that was an animal? 
Uh, rustling of leaves warns you of animal life. Okay. So we're looking for tracks. So if we use our context clues, this one was a lookout. Yeah. This one was a muddy shore that might have tracks. This one was a rustling in the leaves. Um, what was that one? I'm sorry. Sorry, is there one? No. Am I missing one? There should be four. Oh. Yeah, we are missing one. This is the lookout. That's the tree. What Didn't was this I just one? do that one? The lookout? It was right there. No, that was the expiration token. Oh. This one was the spiral stairs. That's right. Okay. Um, With a warning, so I'm probably not going to do that. Yeah, and then this one had like no clear path down to the muddy. Mm, yeah, that was the muddy. This was the muddy shore. I don't want to go down there. This was the rustling. I'm going to go for the rustling. Okay. Keep in mind, our mission is to find the tracks. You think rustling animal might lead us there? I just like animals. Okay, do it. A rustling of leaves in the underbrush warns you of animal life. Prepared to face some sort of wild creature, you are shocked to discover a hound with the fine bones and long limbs of a well-bred hunter snuffling in the leaves. <laughs> you, Hi, heard your name? you heard your name, buddy? We found Hi. Oh, yeah, he's out. <laughs> oh, we heard someone outside. <laughs> it better not be the fucking mailman. <laughs> Capture the dog. Befriend the dog. Find the dog's master. I am gonna befriend that dog. Okay. Hunter, it's okay, buddy. Crouching low to the ground, you try to coax the hound closer with a soothing voice. Test spirit, needing two successes. Hi, doggy. Hey, bud. Okay, spirit. Ooh, I'm good at that one. Okay. One. Two. Now some good protecting. Three. Four. So one success, and then what are the two little... It just means you can spin two, because you have to have a symbol in order to spend. How many successes do I need? Two. It doesn't... Okay. So one... Two. Two. Okay. Pass. Barf. The dog's tail beats back and forth as you smooth its fur. It seems to be healthy, and you are heartened when it washes when it washes your hands with its tongue before bounding back into the trees. Gain two inspiration, then discard this search token. What a good boy. I'm glad I did that. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about the thread. It definitely got us closer to our goals. So that's pretty good. I got to pet a dog, so. Maybe I'll show up later. <laughs> All right. Uh, you have one move left. Um, but no actions left? No. Okay. Um, I will go to... Where are you, uh, you going to go? Can I ask that? Yeah, I mean... We can plan this? Yeah, I think okay. we can plan it. I'm going to go... Well, the only thing I can really do of any value probably is here, because this was a stone stair. It's probably cool. There's probably something neat there, but, you know, if we want to stay on track, I need to get there. Or I could move there, but I'm at an odd number of... Squares, yeah. It would take my whole move to go explore up there. All right, I'll explore this muddy thing. Okay. Well, next turn, right? Yeah. I don't have any actions left. Yeah, cool. Now, that being said, do we want to see what's there? Because it could be a really tight item. <laughs> Well, I'll be making my way that way, so maybe we should wait till I'm closer okay. if there are going to be bad. Yeah, that's a good point. All right, cool. So my turn now? Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to go one, two, and try to climb up that, that tree stand or whatever. High on a tree, you see a shoddy platform crafted from old lumber. You leap for the first branch to begin your ascent to test agility. There was. Were you in my square? No. Um, so nearby means you have to be in my... Nope, nearby is in, in the same square or adjacent to. Were you adjacent to me? No. Mm -hmm. I was already, I was looking for that. Okay, so I'm testing agility. I got two. I think I'm going to go ahead and spend an inspiration to make that three successes. And it says, you find yourself in a tangle, the very branches you hope to use instead impeding your advance. You retreat slightly looking for a better path. Gain one inspiration. So that one's not defeated, but likely... They have, like, a grade where you can, you know, need a number of successes. I think that's it for the turn, y'all. Yep. Oh, I'm also determined. What was that? Oh, yeah. Cool. Save that for later. All right, we're ending the turn. Threat's going to go up by seven. Eey. That's it. It is our turn. Who wants to go? Y'all go ahead. My turn's gonna be uneventful, so... It makes sense for you to go first, because if you spend an inspiration, you can hand it to me. Mm -hmm. So if we're nearby, it almost always makes sense for you to go first. Yeah. Alright, yeah, you're just gonna run. Yep. The most efficient is one, two... Mm -hmm. You wanna go here? Yeah. Three, four? How yep. come he can move four? 
Well, you did two actions to move twice. Mm. I forgot you could do that. All right, you, you're oh, up. I didn't even scout. Oh, yeah, we all got a scout, too. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, did we refresh? Yeah. I forgot. So no baddies came out, though. No baddies. <laughs> Dwarves are natural sprinters. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I've heard. Wow, how did I get that so after? I should really mute my mic. It's showing who's talking on Zoom. Oh, well, they're not seeing it, so whatever. Oh, it's not sharing it. All right. Scouting two. Nice. Got the one I really wanted. Prepare that. Put this on the bottom. I like the art on this card. Oh yeah, the art on all of these are great. I mean, they're all from the card game, but they're fantastic. I love the Natalie Portman art that you have. Oh yeah, and Nath, then, Nath Guide. Yeah, and then I think she's daughter. No, that's of not Nath Guide. It's uh, oh god, which one is it? It's the Lament one. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can't remember what it's called. Man. Daughter of the Nimrod. It's not no. daughter. Daughter. She's daughter, daughter of that that's one. That's daughter of the Nimrodell. Oh right. Oh, it, it's not Nath Guide. That's no, the one Nath that's Guide like, is the one that's the, like. Yeah, it's, it's like the autumn leaves yeah. all around her. <laughs> It's one of the... and it doesn't matter. <laughs> Alright, what you got? You want to go now? Uh-huh, hang on, I'm reading this. Before you test, you may look at the top card of your deck. It's not Lorian Minstrel, but that's close. Maybe it is. We can Google it in a minute. Andrew's on it. Good. No. Good no. work. Yeah, totally. Uh, no, he's texting. <laughs> um, okay. I will explore, explore the, bank. the muddy shore. Looking down the muddy ridge, you notice what may be tracks on the shore. Oh, you're going down to the shore? I'm going down the shore. You got the you Devon room? You get the room? LaCroix. All right, go ahead and uh, test agility. Mm. My best. That's, what should his agility look like? The tornado? Ugh, oh, stupid. Whammy. Okay, so I guess one success if That's I spend an inspiration. And I get to get it. Because of your character ability, right? That's right. Yeah, we gotta remember that. That's big. Alright, one success. You slip and tumble <laughs> down, sliding across the tracks you were attempting to investigate. From atop the ridge, the footprints look large for a man, but you cannot be certain of that, nor of their course, now that they are gone. Suffer one face down damage, then discard this search token. Great job, Elena. Oh my god. You pet a Shut dog up. and then slid all <laughs> over the footprints. I successfully friended the dog. I'll have you know. Okay, you still have an action left. Um, I guess I'll go here and yeah, explore that. Makes sense. Do I take the token away? Uh, it probably, but we can wait. A wide path and a crumbling ruin mark an abandoned post of trade. Discard the token, gain an inspiration. Markings on a crumbling wall show that there used to be an advanced civilization here. Ooh, there used to be an advanced civilization right here. And that's it. Okay, you have one move left. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. You started here. Explored and then moved. Oh, right. Is this another square? I can't tell you. Yes. Yep. yep. I'll move here for next turn. Okay. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna move you off that so we don't forget it's there. All right, uh, so my <laughs> turn. Oh, boy. Yep, thanks for... Thanks for being on defense. Full defense. There's a predator out there. Might be. All right, I'm going to first action climb this tree. You gaze up at the tangled tree trying to determine a better path. Climb. Test agility. One, two, three. I know, bud. All right, I'm going to spend Hey, I'm going to spend two inspiration. I got two successes. And pulling yourself onto the rickety structure, rickety structure, you gain an exceptional view of the area, gain an inspiration, then discard this token. I should have three. What a big fluffy boy. You cast your gaze deeper into the wild. Perhaps the remaining thieves and their allies from Mount Graham are hiding in those hills. 
All right, two oh eight A. Galadrium minstrel. That's what it is. Thank you, Coach. Galathrum minstrel, right? I'm sorry. Yes. Galathrum minstrel. What ha what happens there? Nobody goes there. It's a hole in the world. <laughs> we will talk about that. Just like doing a huge pit. Three oh five. Yeah, you just get pitted. Yeah, gotta get, <laughs> gotta get pitted. Gotta get pitted. I wish Luke were you here. Just climb in. You just get spit right out of it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, I want to go listen to the auto-tuned one. Like that? Yep. Okay. Wasn't that long, had a child. Don't like oh it. Oh my god, 209A. 209, eh? <laughs> Just keeps going. Like that? Yep. Like that. Don't fall oh, asleep. All right, need some exploration tokens on these. I'll see if I can get some of them cleared out. You compare the information you've discovered with what you already know of the region. Seeing no obvious signs of the layer, you begin to surmise where the layer may be and continue your hunt. Lore increases by one. Tracks needed are now two. So Wait, what leave is it to Barivor to like. What does that mean? Remember we need to find three sets of tracks? Yeah. We've done two now. Oh, okay, good. All right, so I still have an, a full action left. I am going to discard Trailblazer to sprint, which is before I sprint to gain an inspiration. And then don't let me forget that I also get the scout after I sprint. So I am going to sprint. Did I miss one? Was there supposed to be one here? Nope. Yeah, there was supposed to be one there. I just can't even register anything. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll do my best to keep track of it. All right, so I'm sprinting, and I think I'll go... I'm going to leave that one for Elena. I'll come down this way, I think. So I'll go one to sprint there. Man, I'm going to run out of inspiration. I'm, or I'm going to max out at inspiration. So maybe I won't fully explore everything so you guys can grab it. But also the threat. Just do it. I mean, what's the worst? You're just not going to get the inspiration. Well, I mean, I can grab that and then go over there if nothing bad happens, but something yeah. bad might happen. <laughs> oh, yeah, and I guess we're about to hit a threat We are about to hit a threat threshold, but that's going to happen either way. Yeah. Maybe I'm not going to sprint. What happens at a threat threshold? Something bad. Bad stuff. <laughs> like bad guys? You know, whatever. I'm going to sprint. Can open that? Oh, I don't have time Lid, what was here? Tiny. What was the thing there? That was uh, an old civilization. You know yes. what? I feel like as a ranger, I'm gonna I'm gonna hedge my bets. I am gonna sprint there just to get one thing explored, just to see what it looks like. Several makeshift bridges. Actually, you have no. Insp oh, you have one. All right, all right, all right, all right. Several makeshift bridges and gates have been trussed to the crumbling ruins. An old stone signal tower, long past its prime. right there a small cairn of stones is draped with green garlands you know what I think I'm probably going to just explore that since it's in my space I want to explore the green garlands though and this I get this but I'm, I'm capped out so I am going to spend my second action oh I get to scout one when I sprint cool got my got my weakness did we do the uh, rally face? We're not there yet. I'm okay. still I'm still going. All right, I'm now going to just explore the green garlands. A small cairn of stones is draped with green garlands. The garlands are woven leaves and vines with a few blossoms dotting the verdant ropes. The cairn of stones is well balanced, the stones polished and clean. The stubs of a few candles are melted into the ground around the array. Test spirit needing one success. Which I got pass. This must be some sort of shrine or memorial. You light the candles and sit before the festoon stack. You empty your mind, then take a few slow breaths. You feel at peace here. Man, flip a face down or discard face down. I'm not harmed, so big old fat waste. That's it for the turn, I think, y'all. We ready? All right, here we go. First threat threshold. Should be fine. I feel okay. 
shadow phase. Don't shadow deepens, though hope yet endures. From a nearby tree line, you hear the warble of an unfamiliar bird. Then, without further warning, arrows whistle through the air around you. Each hero tests agility, needing two successes. Each hero who fails suffers two face-down damage. God damn. I should do well with my one agility. Nice. Yeah, that should be fine. Well, I succeeded one. one. All right, I actually got two successes, so I made it. So I take two face-down damage. Take two uh, face-down damage. I will spend an inspiration to pass this. Is there anyone yep. nearby? No, unfortunately not. But you pass. Andrew's done, so we're good to move past that. Uh-oh. Place one orc hunter. Man, all Which these hunters. Which one are they? They're the dude with the bow. And he goes right here. There you go. You're being good as the monster queen. That's my middle oh. name. Queen monster. Place one orc marauder. That's the dude with, like, the axes, I think. Yeah. He goes right there. Just one. And that's it. Rally phase. So time to scout. Shuffle up. Shuffle up, I guess. Shuffle up. Oh, God, I hate having to repeat dumb things people say. Well, <laughs> you're in good shape today, since nobody's going to say anything dumb. True. Yeah. Not one person. Good point. Awesome. Keep getting the one I want. Good for you. Yeah, I'm pretty proud of it. Oh, shit. Alright, team. We gotta find some tracks. None of these really looked like tracks, right? Let's let's just take stock of what we have on the board. Oh my god, come on. We have got markings showing there used to be an advanced civilization. Might be a cool item there, though. We might be able to afford some time to look at that. Gimli, where you are, is an ancient spiral staircase leading down into the ground. And there is one here, which is an old stone signal tower. So none of those seem particularly track-worthy. Um, what do you guys think? Go ahead, you tell me. You want me to go first? Sure, yeah. Um, I would like... So here's my plan. I'm going to explore the ancient yeah. civilization, and then I'm going to go and explore that token. I think that makes total sense. All right, markings on a crumbling wall show there used to be an advanced civilization. You wonder what the markings could mean, but they are in an ancient text that takes some effort to decipher. Test wisdom, needing three successes. What's your wisdom? Three. You know you can stack those on the spot. They're supposed to be stacked. I, I The light is reflecting and I can't read. I'm just saying your inspiration thinks... I don't want to do okay. that. Okay, all right. <laughs> One, two... Three. So I will spend two. Um... Spend two to pass. Mm -hmm. The markings clearly show how to open a hidden area of the ruins. Within the cold stone walls, an ancient treasure lies waiting. Lore increase by one, then discard the search token. What's my treasure? I guess that was it. Just. I didn't miss anything, right? Yeah, I guess the lore. It was just the, the lore. Treasure. All right, cool. Well, what's, what's the lore? Lore is basically our money. It's like how we upgrade our gear. Mm. All right, well, you got one action left. So I'll go one. Well, you just go one, and then it gets explored. Oh, okay. So then you can decide what to do with your next one. Because that happens automatically. This is going to go to you. An ancient oak presides over the stretch of hill land, and a rocky slope conceals a bear den. Journey continues, so there's nothing there. So you got one move left. Where are you going to go? I'll probably go explore this and then move down here, I think. Do I have to do... I guess I'll move into the square that you are. Yeah, makes sense. Man, I love that harp. That's a cool-looking figure. Mm -hmm. Elena. All right, so that's it for you. Mm -hmm. Andrew, you want to go? You have a, any idea what you want to do? I mean, I'm tempted to just... Run it's, and smash? Oh, uh, no. Or search and... Search. Because I figure, you know, it's going to help us in the long term. Whatever yeah. we can get I'm done. also full on inspiration, so you could maybe search and move. Yeah. And then I could do cleanup on any 
things we find that look interesting. Right. All right, let's start with search and see what happens. Try that. There cool. are baddies, then I'll change things. All right, here you go. An ancient spiral staircase. Stepping lightly down the worn stairs, you come to a winding passage. Holes in the floor, slots in the walls, and dark recesses in the ceiling, worn of traps of every kind. Navigating the deadly hall will take long and careful work, or extreme luck. Either run it, or proceed carefully. It's going to be agility stuff, isn't it? Run it's probably <laughs> agility. Proceed carefully is probably wit, or maybe wisdom. Neither of which I'm great at, but, but I gotta do one now. Agility, right? Yeah. Well, let's proceed carefully. Proceed then. carefully. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's agility! You spend some time studying the first section before proceeding. You carefully enter, sidestepping the first blade an inch forward. Test agility. I can't pass two. Too. You still have to test it, so just discard a card. Great success. Cool. Fail. <laughs> Even with your caution, you cannot avoid the cruel mechanisms. You attempt to master the first section, but after a few hits, you retreat to deal with your wounds. Suffer three damage. Wow. I can help you, by the Flip way. face down. Suffer one face down. Fear. Uh, here. Then flip. Ouch. And flip one fear face up. Then flip this card face down. Great. You, you randomize it when you flip one face up, so you don't know what it is. Oh, I've only got one. Oh, oh, it's a face of fear. Gotcha. Um, you and each nearby hero suffer one damage and discard this card. Oh, no! You son of a bitch! Oh, no! I right, hand me a face of damage. Oh, that's going to max me out on damage. Oh, really? Yep. You, you're, you're there? I can... Well, it might not, because it might be a discard or something. or Because a... yeah. some of them do have discard this. Discard one inspiration, then put discard face down. So flip God. this, and then discard. Is that what it said? Flip yes. one face up damage and then discard. Oops, so shit. then you do what it says. Flip this card face down. Okay. All right. So unfortunately, Andrew has fallen. You died. Died. Uh, first. Uh, what is it called? Yeah, is it's, a, it's called the last stand. So we are testing a last stand with Gimli. Confirm. This is damage, and Gimli will be testing agility, oh my God. needing one success with no. I got it. You got it. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Oh my god. Discard all face down damage. Gain an inspiration. Continue the adventure. Nice. Whew! Good now going. they get harder as time goes on, so. Houses. That hurt, man. Gosh. You're like, hey guys, I found a. Th <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, you still have one action left. Uh, I say we just leave that. Yeah. I'm there's probably something that. awesome in there, yeah. to be honest. Is that the stone staircase? Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I mean, I'm I not. could go for it. If yeah, one of you guys. With it. I mean, I could go explore that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, what's that one? That's a stone ruin. Oh. I can go try this thing. I mean, my agility's decent, and I have an auto success on agility. Oh, wait, no, I don't. But I, I'm maxed out on inspiration and stuff. Yeah, fuck it, do it. All right, but you, you still got your turn, so you got to come down here. I guess so, Explore. Yeah. I could use an inspiration anyway. <laughs> yeah, that hurt, man. Yeah. You're my inspiration. Thank you. You're welcome. I get that a lot. Mm-hmm. Peering through the brambles, you find a boggy lowland. A rustle of movement draws your attention to the bulrushes. Place a search token, as indicated. And that is a patch of bulrushes may hide tracks amid their stalks. What probably, is a probably. patch of what? Bulrushes? They're is that like, like bushes? Yeah, they're um, like reeds, I think. A thicket sits quiet and still, its shifting shadows possibly concealing tracks within. Alright, so you're clearly in the spot we need to be. But, uh,. Maybe, I'm getting greedy. Maybe don't explore that. I'm going stuff. for it. No, man, good right. I'm going for there it. There might be a dog down there you can befriend. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm going for it. I'm 100%. So I'm going to do a move action. That's my first move. Now I will interact with this and hope for the best. An ancient spiral of stairs descends into the earth, carved into an even older cave. Blah, blah, blah. We know. Uh, I'm going to proceed carefully because it was definitely agility for you, right? Mm -hmm. I have an okay agility. All right, agility needing two successes. Oh, my God. My weakness. Okay, I got it. Just barely. I'm going to spend two um, inspiration to pass, and I do pass. You master each section before pressing on to the next. The work is taxing but proves worthwhile. Halfway through, you discover a small section in which you can rest without fear of injury, and you note the path you have taken before continuing on. Oh, it's an action to continue, which I, I don't have an action. But that means someone else could. So, Lid, you could come and finish it out, maybe. I can't continue because it takes an action. Only the larger, more complex area remains. There's probably something worth it. No, you could also look at this as a sunk cost fallacy, so. All right, I am going to... Let's go to discard. 
I'm going to move here, and then I'm going to discard Trailblazer to sprint, and before I sprint, I get an inspiration. I'll wind up here, and then after I sprint, I get to scout one. Oh, that's pretty sweet. But... I don't want to prepare that. I wish that if you, when they make you do tests, if you like super pass it, like if you super succeed, then you had like the option of. Some do. Some some That's are right. some like are you, you either pass or fail. Some you tell it how many you got. Yeah. All I right. remember that with the tree stand that one time. That's it for my turn. Mm -hmm. I think. So it's over to you, Lid. Then I go first. Did you? Yeah. Oh yeah, because you explored and you've gone. So that's everybody, right? That's all. Yeah. Oh, okay. Then here we go. It's gonna be oh, we're totally gonna hit, fine. We're gonna yep. hit another threat threshold. Dang. Threshold. Alright, move one and attack Barivor, closest hero. Cannot, so no target. And we'll instead move two spaces clo towards the closest space adjacent to a hero. So probably one. Actually, that gets her adjacent to Elena. So that gets him adjacent to Elena. Okay. This bad boy, move one and attack Elena. No. Move two spaces towards the closest hero. Okay. Threat increases by six. This is probably not going to be great. An elderly crow perched in the shadow of a dying elm watches you with malicious intelligence. Its incessant cries grow louder and shriller until it erupts into flight and streaks over your head, followed by the cries of more dangerous foes. That's fine. Okay, cool. An elite orc marauder. Lid, need an orc marauder. What do they look like? That's the axe boy. He's got this. What does that mean? He's just nastier than normal. Oh. Oh my god. Another elite. <laughs> Another elite orc marauder. This is fine. How do you tell it's elite? This is a symbol of the red background. Oh, mm. gotcha. I like the sound it makes when it like <laughs> introduces. <laughs> Alright, well that's ugly. Rally time. I did get that awesome um, immortality card again. You remember that one? Mm -mm. I don't remember what it does. Uh, rest two, discard at the end of your turn to discard two face down threat or fear. Um, or strike two when you attack, discard to add two hits. That's cool. Okay, well, uh, it's time to get some tracks, methinks. Yeah, I'm we not going to explore that. It's, yeah, it's time to wrap this up. <laughs> <laughs> time to go for it. I can start if you guys want, because I think I can I can get those explored. Yeah. Or at least get close. That's fine. Alrighty. And then I'll go finish this out. Well, that'll go to the bottom. This will go to the top. Okay, ready? Yeah. Everybody gets scooted. I will explore this token. The bull rushes. Patch oh of bull rushes. Two successes right off the bat. What are you doing? Didn't we rally? Yeah, you scouted. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. We'll put them on top. We'll put them on top. Oh, right. Oh, man, I've been discarding them. You've been discarding them? Yeah, because I'm yeah, such an idiot. Yeah, you just to decide. You put them on the bottom, uh. or put them on top, or prepare them. Remember? <laughs> it makes a big difference. Ooh, it I'm does. testing might. That's not great. Here we go. Testing might. One. One, but I'm going to spin determined to discard these and draw two more cards. All right, I'm discarding two to get three successes. Come on, baby. The bog pulls you slowly down and you are forced back, unable to fully explore the area. As you scrape the clumps of mud from your feet, you consider which area of the bog to explore next and how long it may take you. Dang. Uh, well, I'm just going to try it again. What else What else can we do? And then I got a plan, too. Y'all are going to dig this. Search again. You trek back into the bog, attempting in vain to stay free of the mud. Test might. Come on. I'll spin this to get two. Be completely out. But I got a plan. There we go. Pushing aside tall reeds, you locate deep tracks in the mud. Items of armor and a large shield have been cast off, discarded by desperate travelers as they sank into the bog. Their escape left a clear path, however, and you note the direction. Gain an inspiration, then discard the search token. With the clues gathered and the enemies you have faced, you begin to fear that this is no layer of exiles and lowlifes. 
What you are closing in on is a stronghold of the enemy, fledgling though it may be. Your fears, unfortunately, have proved true. A darker purpose and master is being served here. Lore increased by one, tracks needed are now one. So we're almost there, but I'm not done with my turn, because I am going to sprint with paths unseen. So first, before I sprint, I get an inspiration. Then I'm going to sprint, and paths unseen says, After you sprint with this skill, you may place another hero in your space without provoking attacks. I'm going to pull you down here. Thanks. Yep. And then, after sprinting, I get to scout. Hmm. I'm going to prepare that, actually. Okay, that is my turn. Who's next? Me. Sounds good. Okay, you going to search that? Mm-hmm. A thicket sits quiet Wait. and still. Okay. It's shifting shadows, possibly concealing tracks within. Peering into the dark depths of the thicket, you find your eyes locked with another's, an orc's eyes. Ugh. Dark pits of contempt and hatred gaze out at you, you have found an ally of the thieves. Test wisdom. I know I have two successes coming. Loosen up. <laughs> oh my god, I got three successes. Three successes? That's probably pretty good. All right. You step into the thicket and the orc inside stumbles back, caught in the tangle of branches. With a flash of steel, it lashes out then breaks away, leaving a hint as to the direction of the lair. It has dropped its knife, however, and you pick it up for inspection. The dark, brittle metal is the cheap craft of Mount Graham. Why and how are these creatures so far from their vile and distant home? Lore increases by one. Then discard the search token. Oh, tight. All right. At last, you have located the hidden lair of your enemy, nestled in an old ruin. Faint silhouettes of orc sentries dot its high, ruined towers, and you see more movement within. Aware of your nearness, they scramble to ready a defense. For you, all that remains is to devise a way in without their notice before the defenses are prepared. Lore increases by one, place a search token as indicated. That is our goal right there. Sneak in. Final objective, infiltrate the lair. With the knowledge of your destination, you observe outposts and patrols that until now were hidden from your notice. Oh boy. Cool, big old warg right in our space. Two. That is, in fact, two hungry wargs that are also elite. So this is good. Mm -hmm. This is everything's fine. But look at those good boys. Are we all in the same space? Yeah, we sure are. Nope. <laughs> Getting a little crowded. Cool. Did you spend inspiration? No. Yeah. Because yeah. I got three, three successes. successes right now. You do still have a, an action left. Can I fight a? Yeah, a you sure can. You can fight a warg. Okay. How do I do that again? You uh, look at your weapons. I have a dagger. So, two successes, I hit three. One success, I hit two. But then I also have the immortality card. Cool. All right. Okay, so what am I testing? Wit. Wit. Three. Thanks. One. Oh, son of a bitch. Three. Okay. So I'll spend these Okay. for two successes. So that hits three. Okay. Um, and then you give some other And then, right? hold on. And then I'll discard immortality. When you attack, discard to add two hits. Okay, so five hits. Uh -huh. And then someone uh, nearby... Uh, Gimli. <laughs> ...gets yeah, an inspiration. Gimli, you can have it. Thanks. You're welcome. All right. You stabbed them, but now they're going to attack back. Ugh. No One damage and four fear. Spirit negates. Me? Mm -hmm. oh. At least your spirit's good. How do I do this? Four spirit. You, you test or your spirit. Oh. Wonderful. Nothing. <laughs> Not one thing. Not one thing, nope. huh? And all out of inspiration. All out of inspo. All right, well, you're taking one damage, then four fear. Here's your Face damage. up or down? It's always face up unless it says otherwise. Keep this card face up before you interact with a threat token. You must spend one inspiration. Discard one inspiration, then flip this card face down. Well, I don't have one. Flip this card face down. Flip this card face down. 
Ugh, that looks nasty. Deplete another hero's... What's that little guy? Mm -hmm. It's a, it's a, it's a, a trinket. A, a trinket. Oh, okay. It, it, it won't do anything. Okay. Without resolving its effect, if you cannot suffer one <laughs> face down, is that fear? Yeah. What's your fear threshold? Six. Okay. So you're, you're one away. You're fine. You're fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Uh, do I still have a... No, I don't have any actions, do I? Nope, no. you're all done. When... Oh, wait, is it the end of my turn? Yes, it is. Tight. What, does this go away? No. Um, does it say? What does it say? Let's do what it says. Flip, face. flip, face down, okay. At the end of your turn, you may discard the skill to prepare a song from your discard pile. That's probably a good idea. I'm going to prepare that Natalie Portman song. Mm-hmm. The Natalie rap. During your turn, you may discard the skill for you and nearby heroes to collectively discard up to four face down uh, fear and. Um, You're still during your turn. Yes, I am. Tight. So that'll go right back into my discard. So I'm going to be greedy and just do it for myself. Mm, yeah. One, two, three. I have pretty good fear, but not good yep. damage, so I'll get cool. rid of that. All right. Oh, wait. This is here too, right? Yes, it is. Oh, my God. I almost died. Does it say face down, or can you discard that face up? Keep this card face up before you interact with a threat token. No, no. You Your must. Your song? It's face down. It's face down. Okay, cool. All right. Well, you're up, Andrew. Uh, I'm just going to pass. Yeah. I, I, I think hide. we're good. Um, and there are opportunity attacks in this, right? There are indeed. If you leave, they will attack you. Although they are exhausted. Yeah, so you could actually leave, and they won't attack you, because they attack back, which exhausted them. I hate... Uh, it's, I'm the last one left, right? You're the so last it kind of makes sense to go do that token. I think it does. To at least try. Yeah, gotta try. Because, well, we're not gonna thread out this turn, but we're not gonna these guys out, are all gonna We've got lots of bad guys coming. All right, let's see what happens. Okay. Interacting with that token up. Okay. All that remains is to devise a way in without their notice. Test. What is that? Uh, wit. Uh, which, uh, mm -hmm. It's like a star with like a okay. hat on it. If I would test wit, I can test might instead, so I'm gonna. I think, is that only to negate, though? That's your armor, right? Oh, to negate, you're right. Yeah. My bad. It's so, weird to like armor your way into yeah. a stronghold. Oh man, I forgot I have a cloak. It's, it's only for face down, though. I don't think you took any face down, really. Before you suffer... Two. No, no it, it doesn't Oh, say mine's face down. face down. Yeah. Well, you were out of inspiration anyways. Yeah. You got two? Yep. Okay. The patrols, though lacking in vigilance, are surprisingly numerous, and you are not yet able to locate a way in. Should elites exhaust? Huh? Should elites exhaust? I mean, the, the app exhausted him when he attacked back, so I didn't choose to do that. Okay. Um, I think they get to make unlimited opportunity attacks, though. They get something else special. Okay. I guess uh, I get one move left. You have one move left. Move back in with you guys, or? Well, if they swarm this space then we're going to provoke opportunity attacks to interact with that. So you almost could run and, like, you know, try to get them to, to come after you. Yeah. That's cool. I'll be, I'll be fine, right? or, or stay there. I don't know. So what happens if someone loses a hero? We lose at the end of the turn. But then what do we do? Do we just move on to, like, the yeah, next yeah, right? Yeah, okay. you, you go on it, but it kind of, like, snowballs a little. Hmm. So what would be the downside of me just staying here? If a bunch of enemies swarm into that spot, if we, we enter, we can't interact with that until they're all defeated. But realistically, I can probably finish this out in my next turn. But you'll take an opportunity attack from every single enemy that's in that square if you interact um, with it. Well, he's not going to get there, but these two are. Well, only one enemy's going to get there. He'll shoot at you. Yeah, it's only going to be one dude. I think I'm just going to stay there. Stick then. it out. Because then I can interact twice. That's such a Gimli thing to do. Yeah. So we're done, right? You were you were last? Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Everything's going to be fine, fine, fine. Here we go. Hold on to your butts. Okay, move one and attack Gimli. So this archer is attacking you. Wait, is that the right archer? Yep. Archer is attacking you. You sure? No, you were taking two damage, one fear, might negates. There's a predator. I, see, I hear that. Um, I might as well just spend. Well, no. Maybe I'll spend one. Did you put a success back on top after you fought those wargs? I don't 
I didn't fight the wargs. I fought the wargs. You didn't attack them? No. Oh, you moved. And yeah, that's right. Um, yeah, I'll spend one to make it two. two so I'll just take okay. the. I guess I'll take the. The damage. I have more threshold for damage. All right. Let us pray. Exhaustion. Keep this card face up. When you scout during the rally phase, you cannot place cards back on top of your deck. Ooh, I like that. That's fun. That's awesome. That's basically how I've been playing this whole time now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And this orc marauder that has nothing, move one and attack Barivor, but doesn't have a target. So we'll move two spaces towards the closest hero. Ends up there. Okay. Elite with the yellow flag, move one and attack Barivor, cannot. So instead moves two spaces towards the closest hero. Hey, what's up, man? Okay, mm -hmm. this Marauder moves one and attacks Barivor, cannot. So instead moves two spaces towards the closest hero. So that basically puts him here. You best get into that lair. <laughs> <laughs> Threat increases by six. Okay, rally phase. Hunter sometimes barks. Yeah, keep yeah. those, keep those predators at bay. God, does he hate the mailman at your house? Because he loses his shit he cannot here. Handle like, he mailman. runs between both windows, just like yeah. barking continuously. We blocked off the stairs so we couldn't go upstairs to the front door and see uh, the mailman. <laughs> to see passerby. Yeah. Alright, Scout and Meduse. Oh, well, found my fear. So, can't put it on top of my deck. So that means I put them on the bottom of my deck or prepare them, or I guess. Or prepare them, yep. So I guess I'll just prepare this ready defense thing. Oh, by the way, woof, 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 woof. And Lid, you can give yourself an inspiration at the start of the turn. And I will. Well, at the start of your turn. I will at the start of my turn. <laughs> When you move into a space, you may discard the skill for you and up to two nearby heroes to gain one inspiration. Seems, Are we all going to try to enter the lair? No, y'all don't want to try and do that. I, don't or, think. I guess it's just better to have the success at the top. Probably. What's the tree? Wisdom. Meh. Hunter, buddy, thank you. Come here. Hunter! There's a truck outside. I can yeah. hear it beeping and backing up. It's the recycling. Yep. He does not like it one bit. Alright, who wants to go? I mean, any reason for me to not just go ahead and get it over with and see what happens? That way you guys can, not, if it doesn't work out, you can yeah, no, no reason act I can accordingly. See. He's gonna whack you, though. Nah, he probably doesn't want to. We became buds. Is this like the final, like we're all gonna die or make it here? Yeah. Okay, good. Pretty much. I have to be. Let me just, we can look at him. He's definitely nasty. You could you could get really lucky and and kill him, but you'd have to get really lucky. In fact, can you even actually with your prepared skills or anything? I don't think so. Oh, hi, buddy. Probably I feel can't. so much safer now. Yeah, thanks, thanks, Thank Hunter. You. Appreciate that. All right, I say go for it, dude. Yep. All right, but you will provoke an opportunity attack. I believe that happens first. So that is him. Hey, that's not so bad. Mm. An orc screams a phrase of such profane intensity you are sure you have been cursed. Oh, no. And then you discard an inspiration after the attack. But it's it's um, it's um, spirit negates, but you can turn that into might. Might as well. <laughs> you like that, guys? Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Um, so You're going to discard your inspiration. Right. <laughs> Hunter! Hunter! So I'll take one, then? Take one face-up damage, yep. Discard two prepared cards or suffer two face down damage. Ugh. Oh, wait, hold on. I could have added one success hey, to that. Hey, 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 buddy. Buddy. Hunter. <laughs> God, he's losing his mind. <laughs> <laughs> Let me backtrack that because I had ready defense, so I could actually add one success okay. to my defense. So cool. I'll just shuffle so this. Nothing. Yep. Okay. See what so happens. that's it. Yep. yep. Okay. So that is confirmed. And he is. Is he exhausted? Can he do it again? Yeah, he can. All right. I'm just. Yeah. I was just seeing if they can. Like, if you have to interact again, right. will he attack yeah. you again? All right. You going for it? Yep. Here we go, dude. Good luck. 
Knock it out. Test wit. Okay. Don't screw this up. One. One. <laughs> not having No any. cards to help there, huh? Um, let me make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay. Not yet able to locate a way in. Going for it again? I guess I gotta, right? True. You gotta. Crope. Okay, two damage. Might negates. Got it. Okay. What a wimp. And is that... Yep. All right. Second action. Oh, yeah, you already yeah, you did that because that was the. Uh... All right. Test wit. I don't want to test wit. On. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is going well. Nothing. Oh, boy. Okay. That's not great. Not great. All right, well, you want to go, with? Lid? You're going to provoke an attack from these wargies, and then an attack from him. Oop. What's my other option? I mean, I have to try it. I mean, otherwise we're fighting these guys, and over and over. We do and have over. some time before the next before the next threat thing. I mean, Not we, we probably much. we yeah, but we, we're only going up by six. We're at. 33 out of 40, so yeah, we could have taken this turn to fight, and then next turn, hope for the best. I'm gonna hope for the best now. Hey, hold on. To, okay. I could go, because if I can hit these guys, I can stun them, and we won't take an attack of opportunity from them. Then why don't you go? Why don't I go? So I'm gonna attack with my staff. I'm attacking with agility. Now it's, yeah. So I am attacking these wargies. Attacking with the old staff. Two and three. So I got one success. I need two to stun him. Testing, testing. We just got this skill to convert one and scout one. Yeah, let's see. I want to be able to sprint though. Next turn, you may just got the skill to discard fear. Don't have that. Clever. Oh, I have a clever wit too, which will help up there. So, alright. I'm going to discard one of these to turn that into two successes, which is three hits and stun. Alright, so they aren't doing anything else this turn. Okay. Then I am going to discard Ways of Old to sprint. And before I sprint, I get an inspiration. And after I sprint, I get to scout. I was supposed I to have discarded Daughter of the... Or, Ancient Wisdom. Yeah. Put that down. Uh, okay, I'm going to put that on the bottom. Then I'm going to test this, but first I'm going to provoke an opportunity attack from this elite boy. <sighs> okay, three damage. Agility negates. Agility is three. Got two. That's about as good as that's going to get, so I'll take one damage, please, sir. Flip this card face down. Okay, these are discarded. And now, finally, with my last act, I will try to scout this. I am testing wit. I'm going for broke here. So I got time of need and undying might. I'm going to discard clever wit, which will add one success, and then I'm going to discard both of these. So I got three successes on that wit test. Slipping past the last patrol, you find a way into the structure without raising an alarm. The heroes win. You have caught the bandits by surprise and will face the bandit leader on even footing in the next adventure. Lore increases by two. Each hero receives four experience. Right in here, guys. <laughs> cool. That was easy. Yeah. And I'll tell you what, my computer is at 4% battery, so we are going to take a break right here, and we'll be back in just a little bit, y'all, when we get the board set up for round two. Thanks for joining us. Be right back. Hey, everyone. Welcome Ooh. back to...